I am going to be doing sort of like an unhaul, I guess. I'm gonna be showing you some of the clothes that I'm gonna be getting rid of because I have bought so much recently and I just decided that I needed a little spring clean in my wardrobe and to just get rid of some stuff, you know? So if you'd like to see what I actually choose to get rid of, then keep on watching. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I am obviously going to be doing a decluttering. I'm just gonna be doing an unhaul. I'm just going to be saying about all the things that I'm going to be getting rid of because I've just done a massive, massive, massive spring slash summer clean of my wardrobe. Just getting rid of more and more things that I do not need in my wardrobe that I do not get wear out of. Before we get into this video, please remember to give this video a like because it will really, really help me out. Also, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I make more content like this every single week. And don't forget to hit the bell button to be updated on when the next upload. So without further ado, let's go on with the video. As I was saying, I literally have so, so much stuff that I just need to get rid of. It's crazy. Like I have a massive, massive ass wardrobe full of stuff. There are some things that I keep, you know, just in case. I think a lot of people will have that sort of struggle where you just think, oh, this is really cute, you know, and then you just like never wear it. So. I've taken the plunge again, and I'm just gonna talk you through some of the pieces that I no longer want for different reasons, like they're damaged, or they just look not cute anymore, or I just don't wear them anymore, like they're not my style, I don't get my wear out of them. I hope you enjoy. Obviously, I'm gonna be putting some stuff on my Depop. My Depop will be linked up here, but it'll also be down in the description as well if you wanna check out some of these pieces and hopefully buy some from me because literally the amount of stuff that I am selling at the moment is growing day by day. Like I literally, I'm not exaggerating when I say I literally have four bags of stuff, <laughs> like massive bin liners of stuff. I'm trying to get rid of, just sick of looking at it. I'm just gonna talk you through some stuff now that I am going to get rid of. So the first thing, as you have seen from my last haul, which I uploaded last week, it was my Everything Five Pounds collab with the lovely Simply Saving UK, even though I think she's changed her name now. The first thing I'm gonna obviously get rid of is this cardigan, because she picked out my outfits and this just wasn't a bit of me. So I thought this would go to a lovely, lovely home, someone that will get their wear out of it. But I just wanted to mention that this cardigan actually has been paid for. I'm sort of waiting for the money to come through because it's classed as an e-check. I know, um, I've literally never heard that term or two either, but obviously if it doesn't come through properly or anything, it will still be active. So keep an eye out if you are interested in this piece. It's just like a black cardigan and it's just got a red and white stripe detailing down the placket down the neckline and also on the sleeves and the hemline as well. If you are potentially interested in this, this is a size medium to large. It fits me perfectly and it's a 10 to 12. As I said before, if you're interested, keep an eye out on my Depop because if there is a chance it might still go back on sale. The next thing that I'm selling, unfortunately, are these camo trousers. This is another piece as well from the Everything Five Pounds haul that unfortunately I've decided to get rid of. Obviously they are beautiful, but I love them. They are in a size 12 and they fit me perfectly. I unfortunately already own a pair of camo trousers that are literally the same as these, maybe a little bit wider on the leg. These are so beautiful, but obviously I can't have two pairs of camo trousers that look identical, so keep an eye out for them on my Depop. The next thing that I am selling are these crazy print leggings that I originally got from Primark ages ago. But honestly, I've barely worn them. I think I've worn them like twice in like the few years I've actually had them. But obviously they're beautiful, beautiful, beautiful navy color and they have daisy print all over them. 
They are also a size 12 and they fit me really, really comfortably. They are perfect quality as well. The thing that I am saying about as well in this unhaul is really, really good quality. Unless I literally mention it, hopefully these will go to a good home as well because they are so pretty. Just not a bit of me anymore. They're just not my style. These are a pair of Primark leggings as well. They're just like a green check print all over and they are a size 12 from Primark. I am getting rid of these though because this is really embarrassing but they have like a small hole on the crotch. Unfortunately they're unable to be sold because obviously no one wants that <laughs> but I am going to be putting them in the recycling bin and hopefully they'll be recycled and to some new leggings possibly that someone will really, really love. I'm gonna be getting rid of those, but they are gonna be going to the recycling center. These are also a pair of leggings that are gonna to go to the recycling center as well because they're just very, very worn. Like, I don't know if you can see that, but they're like a snake skin print, which are beautiful. Like I have had my wear out of these and these are from Republic, I believe, and they're a size 10. They're like really, really stretchy. They're just worn out so much. Worn out on the knee, they're worn out on the ass. They're just not a good look anymore. Like, I don't think I could get away with these, definitely not in public. But I already have like a pair of black leggings that I wear around the house. I don't think these are a vibe anymore, to be honest. Like, I don't need two pairs of black leggings to wear around the house. So I think these are a goner as well to the recycling center because no one wants worn out leggings. So the next thing that I'm actually going to be selling is this H&M midi skirt. It's just plain black. I've worn this a fair few times actually, but it's still perfect condition. This is in a size medium. It says a European large. I don't know if you can see that. It's an H&M basic. I think I actually got this on eBay because I was looking for a skirt to wear to interviews. I already have quite a lot of like to view appropriate stuff. I feel like I don't need this and I don't wear this. I don't like the fit of mini skirts either. I just, I, I just don't think they suit me and the shape of this does not suit me either. This um, haul is sort of very leggings themed as you probably will be able to tell. But these are also another pair of leggings which have this really really funky multicolour print all over them. They are beautiful. These are from Primark and they're actually size 8. Very very small on me but they're quite stretchy so you could probably squeeze into them if you're a 10. I have way too many pairs of leggings. I don't need this many pairs. Like they're quite old. The only thing I maybe say is there's like a little bit of wobbling on like certain areas of them. Overall, they're very good quality. Perfect just for lounging around in the house in, but I already have like so many of these options. These are really cute, but obviously I don't need like 10 pairs of leggings. The next thing <laughs> is another pair of leggings, shock horror. It's these new look ones. They are size 10 and they're in a very, very dark sort of like part and print, I guess. This is sort of like a navy color and they've got like purple and I can do sort of check. They're very, very dark. I don't even know if the camera will be able to pick them up. They might just seem like black leggings. They're really cute as well. I just don't wear them. Like I think I've worn them once, so they're excellent condition. And then I have some more leggings. These are also a Primark number and they are in a size A and they are just these lovely sort of like aztec -y sort of pastel coloured leggings which are really really cute. But obviously I have way too many pairs of leggings as I've mentioned and they're really really good condition except the fact that there is a little bit of bobbling as well because obviously I've washed them. The final pair of leggings, so these are from Primark as well and they're just like a dark pink rose print all over. They're really gorgeous. They're a size 12. They have an elasticated waist and they're just super pretty. I just don't get my wear out of them. So next up we have a pair of sort of like black formal trousers like what you'd wear to work. But they are from a brand called Papaya and they were in a size 12. I think I got these actually in a charity shop. They're in like perfect condition. I've only worn them a couple of times. Because fun fact, I actually was part of a choir once, a rock choir. You do sort of like pop songs and stuff. But obviously since I've moved, I've not been able to find a choir around here, which I'm really, really sad about because I love singing so much. I mean, these would be like interview appropriate as well. But as I said, I've already got a ton of interview appropriate 
clothing. I just think these are like a staple, especially if like you work in an office or something, like these are a go-to. So I hope I can find a good home for these as well. Then we also have a blue A-line skirt with buttons down the front. This is a size 12 and it's from H&M and it's just sort of like a mini skirt in an A-line style and it's just got these buttons all the way down the front. This is an absolutely gorgeous colour. It's actually in like a suede material and it's so lovely. The only thing is I find that this sort of style of skirt sort of like looks like the material stretching a bit. Hopefully this can go to a good home because I just don't like the way it looks on me and I've worn this like maybe once or twice and I was considering it. I was like, get over that idea of my belly poking out and I was like, no. This one will also begin on my Depop because it's in perfect condition. Then I also have these trousers. These are from Primark, I believe, yeah. And they're a size eight, but they also have an elasticated waist and they have birds on them which is kind of a really, really cute print. Very sort of like neutral and basic. Like you can wear them with a lot of stuff. I just don't get my wear out of them. They're also gonna be going on Depop as well. Then I also have this tartan skirt from Primark, which is actually quite heavyweight. Like it's sort of like a winter skirt. Like there are a lot of layers to it. And it's just got like a faux leather waistband as well. I can't actually believe I'm going to sell this, but honestly, I have not reached this once. Like, it has no tags, but it's honestly new. I just don't really wear skirts in winter. I always opt for jeans, usually. This is also gonna be going on my Depop as well. Then I also have this tartan shirt that I got from Primark ages ago. That's a size 10, and it's just in this lovely blue and green check. The only thing that, I absolutely love this shirt. Like, it's lovely. It's just slightly too small for me now, because obviously I've grown since. <laughs> I've had this, but this is a size 10, so it's quite snug on me, but you could also wear it oversized if you're a bit smaller than me. I just don't think I'll get my wear out of it because I'll be too self-conscious about the arms being too short. This is still perfect condition, like I've worn this, but it's, you know, I've looked after it. Then I also have this dweeb top from Topshop, I think I've worn like twice. Honestly, I don't like the way it looks on me. It's a bit too cropped. It just goes over my bra line, which I don't know if it's a look or not, but this is a size 12. Oh no, it's not. It's a size small to medium. And I was influenced to get this because Hayley Williams wore it in the Still Into You video. And I was like, oh, I need that. I don't like the way it looks. Just never ever got my wear out of it. It's just too cropped for me. And I just don't feel comfortable wearing it. Then next up, we have this white top by Zara. I believe this is in a small. It's just got a pom-poms all over it. Just super, super cute. Just don't get wear out of this, to be honest. Surprisingly enough, I think this is slightly too out there for me now. It's a bit tacky. Someone might really like this. I think because it's so out there, like a lot of my houses won't go with it. It's in like really good condition. That will be going on Depop as well. And we also have, it's sort of like a mesh top, it's like a long line top. It could almost be like a dress, but it just has buttons at the front. I'm probably not showing you this very well at all. It has buttons all the way down there and it has like mesh paneling and it's sleeveless and it's very, very long line. I'd say it literally reaches my knees. It's sort of more like a long line shirt dress. I just don't get my wear out of this. I find it very, very hard to style. It's beautiful. Like I've barely worn it and it's in really good condition. But hopefully someone will get their wear out of this because I can't seem to style this well at all. I'm also going to be getting rid of this Primark. It's sort of like a long line top dress. Again, because I don't know how to style it very well. Fits in a size 12 and it has zip detailing at the back to obviously help get it on and everything. It's just like got a lovely, lovely, lovely orange print all the way down. Pretty really beautiful and floaty, like perfect for this time of year. I just don't get anywhere out of it whatsoever. I actually paired this with leggings and it looked sick back in the day, but it's just not my vibe anymore. And then 
I'm getting rid of this leather jacket because obviously it's seen better days. I'm not selling it on my Depop. I'm actually going to take it to the recycling centre because it's literally battered. Like, I don't know if you can see how bad that looks. I was going to do a DIY on it. Most, like, leather jackets aren't my thing anymore, surprisingly. I used to really, really love them and dig them and wear them all the time. But I don't think I could actually save this because it's just ripped in so many places. And it just looks so old. Like, all the studs are coming out. And it just looks rough. So, I think that's going to be going to the recycling centre. And then, finally, the last thing that I'm selling are a pair of shoes. Which I'm so, so sad about because they are beautiful. Like, I love leopard print. These are a UK size 6 and they're from Primark and they have a pointed toe. I cannot stand pointed toes. Like they just really really hurt my feet because I've got quite long feet. My toes tend to catch right at the end and they're incredibly painful. But obviously someone probably will get their wear out of these and love them to death. Like they have a really really soft inside. They're like really really comfortable apart from the toe but I mean some people can cope with sort of style boots but I can't at all. They are a little bit battered like on the heel but not really really noticeable like maybe at the front there's a little bit of wear. I'm finally gonna get rid of these because I just don't get my wear out of them. That is the end of my what I'm getting rid of slash decluttering unhaul I guess. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video guys. I really really hope that you enjoyed it and just enjoyed seeing what I'm actually going to be getting rid of. I feel so much better just getting rid of so much crap in my wardrobe. If you enjoyed this video please remember to give it a thumbs up because it will really really help me out. Maybe comment down below if there's anything from this sort of decluttering video that you might check out on Depop that you like because I'd really love to know. As always, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I make more videos like this every single week and hit the bell button to be notified on when I next upload. Thank you so much for watching guys. I'll see you next week. Bye.